I know you dealt with, um, I mean, we've, we've all dealt with, uh, like, uh, crazy work environments, right? Sometimes with just, you know, the schedules and people and stuff like that. I want to know, how did you maintain, like, your sanity <laughs> doing a show like MacGyver? Because what people don't know is, like, the workload that could kind of come along with it, the, the long hours, uh, dealing with different personalities. Mm. It, and uh, I, <laughs> I felt like you always was able to <laughs> maintain, you know, your composure. Uh, and so I, I didn't know if you like meditate, if you vent to your parents or your boyfriend at the time, or like, how did you kind of get through those moments? Well, to be honest, I think it all had to do with my dog. I adopted mm. Sergeant probably six episodes in. Um, before I knew what I was doing, before I had really planted my feet, I adopted him and he changed everything because I didn't think I was going to make it. Um, <laughs> Straight up. He, uh, he changed everything. He just re would remind me to smile as soon as I would see him. I could be literally about to cry and as soon as I would see him, I forget. Um, I think he kind of helped me pull it back together. I'm also, you know, honestly, I've always been a very strong person. My parents raised me to be a very strong person that just lets things bounce off me. You know, I don't let things affect me to the core where it just makes me want to go hide in my room. I, I honestly, I've never had those feelings. I'm able to bounce negative energy off of me and I've made it a habit to do it. Like I make the effort to not let it affect me, you know? So I don't know. Um, nice. Also just standing up for myself, you know, why, why should you ever be afraid of some other human being? Up. we're all the same stand up for yourself who cares what happens that that's probably the most that's probably where strength comes from in standing up for yourself and staying true to yourself and not letting anyone change you for who you are or make you feel like you have to be anything else because of what they want to be or you know letting their negative energy change you can't do it i can't do it and that's probably something i developed from going to school Mm -hmm. People who tried so hard to change me, people who tried to make me feel bad about myself because they felt bad about themselves. I would always know that they're only doing that because they feel bad about themselves. How can I make them feel better about themselves? You know, I'm just going to tell the truth. Straight up. So, yeah, I have, I have a feeling that high school probably prepared me for any bad work environment. <laughs> so, <laughs> and, and from anything from here on out, I'm, I'm ready for it. Right. Bring it. Straight up. What's the biggest lesson you think you've learned uh, from working like professionally and no, 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 not, not like professionally and personally working on a show like MacGyver? What's the biggest things that you, you felt like you took away? Always treat other people with kindness and respect, no matter how stressed or tired or upset you are. Do not project that onto others. I've had to work hard to keep myself from doing that. There's been times where I've been so irritated or maybe one person in particular is annoying me. So it makes me snap at someone else. And I catch that, you know, I check myself. Do not let that shit rub off on others. Like, and that's because I never like when people do it to me. If someone is irritated about something, I don't like when they project that onto me or treat me a certain way because they're irritated with everyone else. And I never want to do that. And so I make an effort to remind everyone else to do that too. Um, when I did the Christmas movie, you know, it was a very low budget movie. Everyone was really stressed. A lot of things were just not right about that whole production. And, you know, as it, it was hard enough as it was already, but people are like snapping at each other, cursing at each other, yelling at each other. And someone has to treat this person bad to make someone else think they're doing their job. Or who can I throw under the bus? Who we throw under the bus? <laughs> That's, oh, a, that's a song we made up on the set of MacGyver when somebody fuck up. We, uh, we sang a song, who we throwing under the bus. <laughs> so, under the bus. I would notice people just doing that left and right. And I'm thinking in my head, yo, this product is way too small for everyone to be acting this crazy. I'm stopping this right now. And I did. I basically made a speech in the morning. And I said, if I hear one more person address someone else with disrespect or snap or curse or yell, I will address you personally on the spot. Do we have an understanding? Everyone's like, oh, yeah, yeah, definitely. Every, everything was so good from that point forward. Everything was so good. Everyone realized nothing was that big of a deal. If something breaks, fix it. If continuity's wrong, F it, who cares? Like, <laughs> it's not a, a Michael Bay movie. Like, let's just have a good time. Like, 
you know? So I don't know. I just, I make an effort now to remind others to treat people with kindness and respect. Otherwise, I'm not going to get through this. Right. What's the point of doing what we do if we're not happy doing it? Yeah, and people, you you spend so much time on a set, you know, you're working on a film or TV, like, uh, you want to make sure it's a safe space and a comfortable space because you're spending more time with the people on set than you are with your own family members. Exactly. Exactly. Um, So you want to be cool. (sighs) A couple more questions I had. So this is what I wanted to know for you. Um, Being a, being a woman in in Hollywood, uh, are there any struggles do you think that being a a woman and a black woman at that, that you're still facing uh, in the industry or have things gotten better? I think things have absolutely gotten better. I just think now we just have to be careful to make sure it stays that way, that we don't allow things to slip under the rug and, you know, allow people to get away with things. Um, As hard as we worked to get where we are right now, you know, finally getting our opportunities to play these roles and finally them giving chances to people of color, we have to make sure that we keep it that way and not get too comfortable. Um, If that makes sense, there's always going to be struggles. Um, as a woman, we have to be on guard 24 seven, you know, as great as everything was in the MacGyver said, I had to be on guard 24 seven, you know, <laughs> because there's always something, there's always something. So in every situation that we're in, that's just, that's just kind of who we have to be. Um, I was going to ask you, I mean, have you felt like you dealt with any, I don't want to say like me too type situation, but was there any time that you felt uncomfortable And if so, how did you maneuver or, you know, because I think that's important for, for women to like talk about. Um, So if there's another woman that might get into that situation, they'll kind of have the tools and kind of know how to navigate through that situation. Naturally for me, this is just something I developed growing up in this industry. You know, I never talked to anyone for too long. Never, never put yourself in a situation that's going to, get you in trouble you know leave the party early don't stay right. too late don't go um, to a man's apartment at three o'clock in the morning That's... yeah no meeting no meetings at anyone's house <laughs> no no dinner meetings hey i want to talk to you about a new project over dinner no thanks right call me on the phone you know i i would just learn to avoid those situations way before they go south because i didn't need them to go south Straight up. i know it's gonna go south i don't need it to. <laughs> I, like come on why why else is this happening so you know and that's just something I, I carry with me. And oh, I was what um and